Hello. In this demo, we will talk about statistical process control trend analysis. SPC measures output of processes looking for small but statistically significant changes so that corrections can be made before defect occurs. Let's see in plant applications modern web client how is it implemented. SPC charts are integrated in activities app. So we go to activities app from left hand side navigation menu. I have done some pre work for this demo and I have activities generated every 15 minutes. There are a couple of SPC charts pre configured for this demo. Click on perform button to perform the activity. Presence of this SPC chart icon on header indicates at least one SPC calculation variable available on this sheet. You click on this SPC chart button to switch to SPC chart view. Plant application supports. X bar range, X bar moving range, X bar sigma, P chart, U chart. Let's take a look at this SPC chart of type X bar MR. Plant applications SPC chart looks at the last n number of data points, and here n is a configurable parameter. And for this demo, I have set this as 30 data points. So it looks at last 30 data points and observes a pattern within the data and determines the state of the process. Now looking at the state of the process, you can clearly know that your process is controlled within your calculated control limits or not. If it is moving within cal calculated control limit, it is good. But if it is have it has some outliers, then you can make the necessary changes to improve the process performance as required well within time. Plant application SPC chart also displays information about calculated control limits. If you hover on any one of the calculated control limit legend, you will see it highlighted on the chart. Another important functionality is to display the real time alarms on the chart itself. If you hover on any data point, it will display information about that data point in tooltip. For example, if I hover on this particular data point, it will tell me variable name, time, data point, and also it will display the alarm which was configured and that was triggered when this calculation happened. The indication of these alarms on the chart for user convenience. These are consistent with alarm indication on this top alarm notification app. Red triangle indicates its high priority alarm. Yellow rhombus indicates it's a medium priority alarm and blue square indicates it's low priority alarm. You will see the similar alarm indications on the chart for those alarms. Similarly, we have support for other charts like X bar range, Sigma, P chart and U chart. You can modify any value and then you can see the real time reflection on the chart itself. So here what we have seen. Plant application SPC control chart enabled you to view information that are important over a period of time. With this visual representation, it will also help you to understand and prevent unnecessary process adjustments by distinguishing between common cause variation and special or assignable cause variation. Thank you for watching this video.